when it comes to the perfect blend for a summer cocktail and creating that perfect cocktail, getting the flavor just right is really key. And these two gentlemen from Pepper Smash in Plano have done just that with their pear and berry drink. Hello, Chris and David. How are you? Good. Doing well, thank you. <laughs> okay, so Pepper Smash is like at the top of my list for the cool new places that I've heard about and everyone's <laughs> raving about and I haven't been yet. And you guys do, um, from what I hear, a fantastic brunch as well. Our brunch is um, outstanding, actually. Yeah. That's what I've <laughs> yeah, heard. Our, our I know, that's why is, uh, it's right up there on the list. Go big or go home. So it's, uh, uh, yeah, <laughs> our brunch is uh, supposed yeah. to be over the top. So it's really, really big uh, uh, versions of comfort food. Yeah. Oh, that's so you know, when you wake, you got a bacon. So we have a wake and bacon oh, burger. Oh, I love it. Egg. Yeah, yeah, I cool say stuff. to my kids, wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. <laughs> okay, so do, are you doing some cocktails as well for, um, for maybe like a later brunch? Well, we have our, um, and we, we always do uh, featured cocktails every mm -hmm. week, and every month we do our Bloody Marys and mimosas just like everyone sure. else. Uh, but also the, you know, our Bloody Marys are, you know, our special secret infusion. Of, of, are off the uh, charts. Uh, yeah. I specifically I really can't, heard that. I can't really tell you everything that goes in there. But, <laughs> All the uh, secret ingredients. Well, yeah, it's it a, is a secret recipe. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so today you're making a pear and berry cocktail. Cocktail. Yes. Okay. And we're going to use, uh, this is a vodka drink, yes? We do. It's a, uh, this is actually a pear vodka, mm. uh, elderflower liqueur. This is lemon juice right here. So and we're going to take 0.5 of each of these guys. Or just maybe like counting to three. Is that how you do it? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's, yeah, two, roughly. In my house, it's three. So anyway, <laughs> and it's an ounce and a half of pear vodka. And then we're going to be doing an ounce Oh, the, it's a blackberry puree that we make in-house. Oh, yeah, we do all the good. all of our purees, everything is from scratch, uh, is made either a la minute or the same day. I'll tell you, and it's with the cooking there too, is all the fresh ingredients make mm -hmm. the difference, whether it's a cocktail or or a dish. That's in case it drops it. Uh-huh. It'll fall back. <laughs> does, it, it, does it get on me? <laughs> yeah. yeah, this isn't the cocktail that you want to spill on yourself, if you're, no. especially if you're wearing white. It truly. All right, and all this just goes in the glass. And this is a good, uh, I mean, this is something you can make at home, but it's also, I mean, it's a, it's a summer refresher. So oh, this that is, is so what simple. what we would call a, a patio pounder. So I've these not are. Had, <laughs> I've not had the pear vodka yet, so I can't wait to taste this. Right, can I just, just with a straw? Yeah. Okay. And we just need to top it off with the. Put a little fizzy in Oh, there. you're not done with it. Sorry, That's I'm okay. so, okay. I get so you're eager. You're ahead of us, anxious to drink. It's okay. <laughs> a little, can, all can, can we make it look? You haven't met me before. <laughs> can we make it look a little beautiful? Yes, please. All right. All right. Right. Of course, I take the drink before it's ready. All right. So we got my fresh manners. Berries. They're atrocious. It's got a nice long piece of lemon zest. We can just drape mm. on so the it tickles top. your That's nose beautiful. while you're drinking it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I didn't notice. Now the elderflower liqueur has some sweet to it, mm -hmm. yes. right? So there's. Hmm. Oh, yeah, this is dangerous. I could drink <laughs> a lot of these. Extremely, that's what I said. We call them patio mm -hmm. pounders, but they are definitely uh, <laughs> sitting right outside in the alley, sun. Yeah. yeah. Um, oh, my gosh, these are fantastic. But they go down very easily. The reason I was asking about the sugar content in the elderflower is because a lot of um, fruit drinks, they'll mm -hmm. add, like, um, simple syrup and things like that, that, that to really sweeten it up. But this doesn't. This doesn't happen. No, I mean, yes, there's good. a little bit of sugar in the uh, purees, but like I said, we it's there's I mean there's nothing yeah. artificial about it. it oh my goodness! It we is try to so make everything good. either a la minute or at least at very least the same day. Will this be available all the time or just for summer? Absolutely, it's all it's, the time. It is. It's actually one of our features right now, and it is. Uh, but it's also on our menu. Okay, quick. Which menu item would you pair this with? Wow, that would, uh, I would probably pair that with something a little spicier. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a... Uh, Saganaki bruschetta. The bruschetta or the spiced lamb flatbread, uh, which is outstanding. Oh, it's yeah. Spiced that. lamb, uh, feta, uh, we do our own pickled onions in-house. Tomato jam. Shigo peppers. Oh, yeah. Uh, tomato jam. Keep and then we actually, talking. Oh, and then we actually <laughs> make all of our bread uh, a la minute as well. So it's made per order. Uh, so it's, we make a homemade naan bread and then so top things it off. to snack on oh, and yeah. then and sip on this. Um, you will love this, I promise. <laughs> um, you can head over to Pepper Smash in Plano at the shops at Legacy to try this yummy drink for yourself and all the great things they have on the menu there. Coming up next, you dancing with the stars, and so you think you can dance, fans? Listen up, we have a sneak peek at an amazing show called Ballroom with a Twist. You can catch it tomorrow night at the Music Hall at Fair Park, and we're going to be sharing a special performance when we.